so much for joining me today. Today I have a Ipsy and Play by Sephora um, box bagging question mark uh so yep i have got both my play by sephora and my ipsy i'm just gonna open them see what i get and gonna compare them so without further ado let's get into the video so i'm just gonna start off with my ipsy bag it's empty right now i have everything laying down over here um so starting off with the bag it's a cute bag i feel like it's a smaller than usual maybe it's just me so inside the bag, we you know we get five items. So starting off, um, I'm gonna start off with this sponge that it came with. Um, I tried to use it today to apply my foundation, and I was using the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Luminous in 825. Uh, this sucked. Let's just put it out there. I wet this and it didn't get any bigger. It just stayed really dense. I ended up just using a different sponge uh, to apply my foundation, but this was just terrible. Do not recommend and this is bad. The next thing that I got was this Hey Honey Uncover Detoxify Mud Mask. I love this brand. I th We got a serum a couple months ago from this brand and I still use it. I loved it. I think I might have it here. Yes. It's the Hey Honey Good Morning Milk Serum. Honey Milk Serum? Honey Silk Milk. Mm. But this one was really good and it smells really good. I feel like I'm gonna love this just because I love this brand. Super excited to try. The next thing we got was a Luna, Luna by Luna. It's an eyeshadow and this is the eyeshadow it's in the color Jace and it's just like a pretty pinky orange let's give this a swatch I feel like this would be a really pretty blush as well I feel like this would be a really pretty crease color or an all over the lid color um, it's perfect for the summer so I'm excited to try this I didn't try it on today I should have but I really like the packaging, the blue packaging. The next thing is this NYX whipped and whipped, <laughs> whipped, and it says foutier. But I'm assuming that means whipped in another language. I'm assuming French. I got the color cocoa bean, and it's a lip and cheek color. This is what it looks like. I tried this on on my lips, and it's just really glossy. Let's just. Can you see that? <laughs> I'm just, I'll swatch it on my hand. Basically, it's this moussey formula, and it's supposed to be for your lips and for your cheeks. It's this one right here. Uh, I don't know if I'll ever use this on my cheeks, honestly, but for sure on my lips. I like how it feels. It's really moussey. It's definitely not transfer proof. It will get on everything. It is really pretty. I like it. Last but not least, we got this Balm Springs Long Wearing Blush. And it comes in a, in a bigger package. Usually we get this little square if it's from the Balm. I wonder if I can take this out and put it in a Z palette. This color is so pretty. I love it. Let's swatch this. And I love Balm blushes. This is so pretty. It's like a, kind of matches this lipstick. This might be a really good duo, but this blush is just so pretty. I am in love with it. Next, I'm just gonna unbox my Play by Sephora. I've already taken everything out of the bag, but this is the bag that we get this month in a summer state of mind. And there's like little swimming people, some girls swimming and synchronized swimming, kind of looking cute. Yeah, it's a cute bag. So let's start off. Um, like you always get a, a monthly perfume sample. Uh, this this month it's the Derek Lamb. I don't know if that says I O or ten, but it's blackout. Um, let's give that a sniff. Sniff, sniff. Okay, I can't really smell it. 
you're not supposed to rub it. So I've heard, but. Uh. <laughs> the next thing that we got in this bag are these Dr. Dennis. This is gross. Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta Glow Pad Self Tanner for Face. And you get three, three of them. I probably will not use this. I don't like self tanning. I just, I don't know. I like the effect of the tan. Or that people, they look nice because I am pretty pale. Maybe I'll try it just to, you know, maybe I'll like it and then I'll be like obsessed with self tanning. But for now, eh. So the next thing we got is this Kat Von D mini liquid lipstick and I love Kat Von D makeup. She, if I have to choose, I think Kat Von D might be my favorite brand of makeup, but the lips, <laughs> this color is outrageous. Let's just go ahead and swatch this. That's right there. That is super bright compared to the rest of my hand. Um, I did put this on today earlier and I was like, oh my God, what is going on? I but I have a couple liquid lipsticks from Kat Von D. They're not my favorite liquid lipsticks. My favorite are the over liquid lipsticks. Those are really comfortable to wear. I like the that we got a liquid lipstick. Um, but the color, I get it. It's supposed to be a summer color, but I don't know. I don't think I can pull this off. Next is this. Tinted moisturizer from Tarte Guard and it has SPF 20. Damn, I should have put this on today. Could have told you a little bit more about it. But you know what? Let's check the color out. And I think I can make this work just by bronzing my face. I feel like my hand is so dark compared to my face. Oh my goodness. You know what? It's not even a real comparison because my hand is tan. Like I said, I think I can make this work. Oh my goodness, but I didn't even notice how much more tan my hand is from my face. Maybe I should use these. So far, I'm, I'm excited to try it. The next thing we got is this Brio Geo Curl Charisma Rice Amino Avocado Leave-In. Um, maybe I'll try this. I Like I said before in a previous video, I'm not sure if you watched, maybe you did. I don't really like hair stuff. I don't use a lot of hair stuff. I don't do anything but wash, condition, and dry my hair. Not with a dryer, with like a towel. And I just let it dry. I don't do anything. I don't put heat on it. Maybe once in a while if I guess I want straight hair, I'll straighten it. But other than that, I don't really do much, so. Maybe I'll try it. Maybe this will make me some curls. Because I have pretty wavy hair. So I don't know if it'll curl it. The next thing is another hair thing. And this is the BB Don't Blow It Fine Hair Styler. For fine to medium soft hair. See, I cannot use this. I'll probably give this to someone that has fine hair. Because I don't. I have really, really thick hair and a lot of it. I'm not sure if you can even tell here, but I have a lot of hair. So, Womp, another hair product. Mm. Wrapping this up, this is Play by Ip versus Ipsy, and I think this month I'm going to have to give it to Ipsy. I know, usually Play wins. For the past couple months, I've liked what I've gotten in my Play by Sephora box better, but just the five things, not including the perfume because that's like a sixth thing there. i not super excited about the two hair things, the... Don't blow it one and the curl charisma. Not super excited about the face tanners. I love this, but the colors just 
not working for me. This is the only thing that I was excited about. Womp. And then it versus this, I I love love Hey Honey, and I love the balm. And this color is really pretty. And this color I'd wear. This was the only fail. Like this sucked, but other than that, four out of five. That's pretty good, Ipsy. So thank you so much for joining me today, and thank you so much for watching my video. I greatly appreciate it. If you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Give a like on this video if you like what you see, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.